Hello, chat. What is going on? We got rent a peak today. Let's fucking go. Are you guys ready? Um, so for those who don't know, whoops, actually one second. There we go. Sorry, I had my chat. <laughs> I had my my um my audio playing in my ear as well and I was like, uh that would not work. Uh okay, hello. What is going on everyone? For those who don't know, this uh stream is happening because over on Twitter, I did a donation drive to Feminine Hygiene Kits for Gaza. Uh the goal was $1200. And I would read three volumes of Rent a Girlfriend on stream. And we hit that goal in less than like 12 hours. So we are doing this stream. I'm reading three volumes of Rent a Girlfriend. I got volume one here on my Kobo right now. Um, I think the funniest thing is that this is the first thing that I've bought on my Kobo since uh, since getting this for my birthday. <laughs> so we are reading three volumes and it's the first series to go on my Kobo. Um, as you may also know, I was supposed to have done this on Wednesday. Um, but I had a funny story that I figured I would let you guys know about. <laughs> so on Wednesday, I was supposed to do it. And then like, I got really nauseous for some reason. And it turns out um, vitamin D, if you take too many or if you take too much, you can get vitamin D toxicity. And some of the symptoms of that are stomach cramps and nausea. <laughs> and so that's what I had. I accidentally had too much vitamin D and that is what happened. Um, let me look at the chat real quick. Sorry, I'm going to be behind a little bit on this. Hello, everyone. Thank you to those who donated already. The three anonymous people and Dania, or Dania, however you say your name. You guys are beautiful souls. Thank you so much for donating. We will talk about what today's donation drive is in just a second. Um... How do you like reading manga on the Kobo? So we'll find out today because this is the first series that I'm going to be reading on the Kobo for manga. Um, I have put articles and like journal papers that I've read on here and that was fine, but uh, we'll see how manga goes. Uh, will we see it on the screen when you read? Unfortunately, no, from what I've heard, showing manga on the screen on YouTube can get you, uh, I don't know if it's just demonetized or can get your video taken down. So I figured the best way to do this would just be, um, I will kind of like read aloud and then <laughs> if anything crazy goes on in one of the chapters, um, I can show this at least. Um, I just want to make sure that I don't get this video taken down for whatever reason. The other thing is, I can always read like this. I don't know if this is the desired way, but I could always do that as well. Um, are you okay? Yes, I'm fine. So, literally some of the worst stomach cramps I've ever had in my life. But uh, it was like, I went to sleep and I woke up the next day and like, I felt a little like blah, but other, other than that, I was perfectly fine. So just kind of have to sleep it off. <laughs> It'll take your Chihai Furu off the number one. Thank you for the donation, anonymous person. Um... Don't take too many again. Yeah, I only took one. Um, 
uh, my doctor said that I, I was vitamin D deficient. So I took one and it turns out the ones at Target are double the recommended dosage. So if you guys get over the counter stuff, always check the dosage. That's that's what I learned. Oh, it's striked if it's a video and fine if it's only live. Good to know. Um, I was going to say, if we hit, I think I put $500 was the donation goal uh, for this stream. If we hit 500, I'll read one extra volume either tonight or I'll read it another night, um, depending on how much I can get through in one day. You'll find out I'm kind of a slow reader. Um, but, so, let's go ahead and before we start, let's go ahead and take a look at the PCRF page. So, the PCRF is the Palestine Children's Relief Fund, and they provide free medical care to thousands of injured and ill children yearly who lack local access to care uh, within the local care healthcare system. Sorry, I'm not very good at reading things. <laughs> um, but this is very helpful to children in Palestine currently who are going through um, what they are going through currently. So if you guys have any, any of the means possible, um, it would be very helpful if you could donate to the PCRF, which is our donation drive for today. Thank you guys in advance for doing so. I very much appreciate it. Um, <laughs> don't force yourself to suffer through it. It's okay. I got I got soju with me. Uh, we got the Jinro grapefruit. So I'm here for a good time, you know? Like, even if it's bad, I'm here for a good time. Um, oh, uh, I think I missed that comment. Are we gonna talk about the shoujo wins for today? So for anyone who was not here or on Twitter or saw my community tab, we got some amazing shoujo licenses today. Uh, not only did we get a three-in-one re-release for Red River, baby. Uh, we also got... Hold on. We also got an ambulance. We also got um, a box set for Vampire Night. We also got Oshini Amagami, which is from the author of Kamisama Kiss. We also got Colette Decides to Die, my favorite series. And then we also got another Ayazawa manga called, uh, I think they're calling it Last Quarter. But yeah, shoujo fans won today. We had an absolute blast over on Omnibus Collector's channel this morning. And we're just, we're bringing it into here. Bringing on the good vibes. I think we should live stream chapter 138 of Jihiro Furu. <laughs> Thank you, Morgan, for the donations. Thank you, Chris, for the donations. Thank you, Anonymous, for donations. You guys are very sweet. Thank you for that. <laughs> Yeah, I finally got Colette, you know? I can finally shut up for once. All right, guys. Are you ready for Rent-A-Girlfriend? Because I, I think I'm ready. I think I, I've hyped it up enough. Let's see if I can... Uh... The, the cool thing about the Kobos is it's got, like, all these little, like, ways to... Let's see. What would be the best way to do this? Hmm. Hmm. You know what? I'll just read it like this. All right. Here we go. 
Are we ready? <laughs> I hope I can make this entertaining. I feel like it's going to be so hard to be, like, reading and actually comprehending anything while also... All right, let's see. Cute as an idol. First, her looks. You're paying to go on a date with a woman. So beautiful. That wherever she goes, heads are constantly turning. A woman in charge. It's okay to be a little nervous. Her easygoing conversation, peppered with jokes, and that sense of intimacy one only gets from a lover will set you right at ease. While you're laughing and gazing at her winning smile, it will feel like time is flying between you and your girlfriend. Your rental girlfriend. <laughs> All right, guys, you ready? Page one, let's go. <laughs> My name is Kazu Kazuya Kinoshita. I'm a 20-year-old college student majoring in business administration. I hate him already. No offense to other business majors, but like, I don't know, for this guy? I live alone in an apartment in Narima. I don't have a job. Okay, that's not surprising, I guess. My parents gave me a million yen on the condition that I get nothing else after this. How much is a million yen? $9,400. Wait. I think I said that right. $9,400. I'm living off that for now. By the way, I have a girlfriend. I repeat, I have a girlfriend. He's got a girlfriend, guys. This guy, he's got a girlfriend. So I actually saw this opening chapter uh, picture, and I was like, immediate red flag, just because of the little, like, Whenever, whenever, like, an author draws, like, the little, like, leg chub, I'm like, mm. <laughs> this could go wrong. I'm sorry. There's another guy I like. Can we split up? What? <laughs> I got dumped! Aww. Within two pages? Poor guy probably because he didn't have a job. She was the first girlfriend I ever had, and she dumps me after only one month? Mommy ma- Oh god. I'm- I'm really sorry that these names are probably not gonna come out of my mouth the right way. Mommy Nama- Nana- Oh god. Mommy Nana Michan goes to my school. I tried everything to get closer to her, but she dodged it all. Sorry, my train soon. Oh yeah, trains are great for getting home. <laughs> she blocked me. Maybe even now, her and that new guy. So is this a reoccurring theme? Where this guy just like thinks of other people like getting with the girls he likes? Is he literally just a cuck? I thought it was just like Mo uh, mommy? What, what would it be? <laughs> what would mommy be? Because <laughs> I didn't think there was another way to pronounce an A. Dude is heavy into NTR. Cool. Good to know. <sighs> ah, ah, this sucks. Plus, I'm getting hard. Oh, oh. Okay. I was like, I don't think there's another way to say it. Because I don't think it would be M Mamie. Anyway. Dude, I, I already got a fucking dick joke. Uh, yeah, it's this early? <laughs> what? <laughs> okay. 
Plus, I'm getting hard just thinking about it. Which way is my dick going on me? Uh, rental girlfriend? Enjoy a dreamlike moment with Diamond's top talent. For men, not used to women. Stress or anxiety about love? Pick your own girlfriend, starting at 5,000 yen for one hour. No private rooms. Physical contact also prohibited. Um, and then he just thinks about this girl getting cocked more, and his dick is hard again. Guys. <laughs> Guys, I didn't think it would be this fast. Uh, the e-reader is a Kobo. K-O-B-O. -O. But also, um... We already have two dick jokes. All right. Duh, I can't stand it. I just can't stand any of it. Sigh, what am I even doing? Just because I'm lonely after my ex dumped me, I'm basically going for a prostitute. I just picked a girl based on her profile. Um, I have to make this joke because uh, my husband made this joke. <laughs> I don't even think he made the joke on purpose, but he, uh, kept calling Ch Chizuru, uh, he called her Chorizo, <laughs> and so I'm gonna call her Chorizo, just because I think it's kind of funny. Uh, okay. Chorizo Mizuhara. Clean cut, sweet, high class girlfriend. By the way, she's the one I'm gunning for, and that's why she's all over my screen right now, because she's my girl. She She's too cute for this series. Look at her. She looks like a sweetie. Um, okay. I'm sure she'll be hideous in real life. And a bitch. <laughs> Orange shirt, striped pants. You're Kazuya-kun, right? Kun. Sorry. I say kun on accident a lot. Look at this pose. Is it because he's a short king? Or I guess the opposite of a king? A short little devil? A short goblin? Charles would know who best girl is. Charles is the connoisseur of Rent-A-Girlfriend in this chat right now. Um... Uh, yeah. Oh, good. I found you. Do you live around here? Um, kind of. This is my first time around here. She... she's really cute. I got kind of lost. How about we chat a bit in the cafe? Uh, sure. What year are you in college? First? Oh, me too. But I did a gap year. Oh, so you're a year older. I don't know why I'm making him sound like Ash Ketchum. <laughs> How is he hating a girl he hasn't met? Are you going to make a video essay of this manga? <laughs> Probably not. The top view from high up and her legs are weird, yeah. Why do they always have these 20-year-old girls listening, <laughs> dressing like their 35-year-old moms? <laughs> oh, that's funny, because literally. Except for, like, the thigh-high socks. Oh, crap. This is totally a date. Her outfit? Her style? She's really attractive. Girls like her sign up for this thing. Whoever her boyfriend is, I bet he's real proud of himself. Oh, man, I'm getting all excited. So, um, if you're ready to pay. Oh, yeah. Damn, I just want to go home. I want to go home and go back to bed. So we follow the plan for our date. We worked out online yesterday. Wait. This is what I mean. I'm not very good at reading things. <laughs> it takes me a second to, like, understand the flow of a sentence. I've never been to an aquarium before. Oh, that's weird. Oh, these guys are cute. Yeah, those gl these are glow light tetras. I read the sign over there. 
But I'm gonna pretend like I, I know everything about fish as a business major. You'd have to read it again to do a video essay. <laughs> that is the worst part. That's so true. Do you know a lot about fish? Yeah, I keep an aquarium as a hobby. Wow, I'm glad I went to my first aquarium with you, Kazuya-kun. Uh, did they hold hands? Because that's not allowed. Physical contact isn't allowed. That was like rule number one. Today was a lot of fun. Thanks a lot. See you See you later, Kazuyukun. And then he's at a fanboy thread for her. That's weird. Uh, thank you so much for the donation. Anonymous, she held my hand at the end too. Anonymous, the business part's just at the start. After that, it was all fun. Anonymous, I keep repeating her smile and see you later in my head. Anonymous, Chizuru, oh, Chorizo Mizuhara from Diamond is one awesome girl. Her voice is really nice too. I guess I'm not her only captive. What? Someone posted a link? I'm confused. Whatever. Th this is crazy! That was all an act? Well, I knew that, but holding my hand at the end was all in the script? She's just messing with me? It's kind of what you paid for. You kind of paid for that to happen. Anyway. I'm gonna give her one star! She's so dumb, she doesn't even know what fish are... <laughs> She's so dumb, she doesn't even know what fish are called. How dare she? How dare she not know what the fish are called? <laughs> oh my gosh, she doesn't even know what the fish are called. <laughs> I might have tears. <laughs> <laughs> oh my gosh. Damn it, messing with people's minds like that? Now listen, you gotta make do with this, okay? Don't get caught up in campus life and waste all your money. Don't be stupid, Dad. I'm going to college to mess around with women. Oh, he said I'm not going to. That's what he looks like pre-college. Uh, he looks like the guy from Ponyo. Like, as a teen. What a burn! <laughs> I wonder why he got dumped! <laughs> oh my gosh, so funny. I... I'm gonna say something to her! Chorizo Mizuhara, you'll pay for this! How dare you do your job! Kazuya-kun, did you wait long? My hair took a while to do. It- Oh, wait. I wasn't sure if you would like this. Wait. God, I can't. I gotta read three volumes of this. I wasn't sure if you would like it like this, Kazuya-kun. But what do you think? I- I don't hate it or anything. Really? Great. God damn it. She's so cute. Who the hell is she? Okay, thank you very much. Hey, doesn't this seem kind of empty to you? Huh? I mean, you don't like the creepy virgins you hang out with, but you date them and get paid for it? Doesn't that bother you? Bro, you paid for her! You're the one who went on this website! Why am I doing this? Why does he suck? Literally, I how many pages am I in? I'm on page 24. And this is 
the worst man I have ever read about. <laughs> what is his deal? Not at all. I really like this job. Plus, I get to meet people with you like you, Kazuyukun. Oh, and guess what? I learned some names of fish for you. <laughs> Oh my god. Will you and your wife be using the same bag? Huh? No, uh, it's not like that. I'm just his girlfriend. But you aren't really right, huh? I mean, you're just some girl, right? Uh, uh, I'll just get you separate bags then. Okay, call me whatever you want, Kazuyukun. Ooh, neon tetras. Look at that, Kazuyukun. So cute. Um, yeah. These garden eels are frady cats. They spent their whole lives in the sand. I gotta admit, she's been studying up on these fish that I made fun of her for not knowing. I fucking love fish! She went through the effort, a lot of it, just for today. Look, just quit it. Huh? Like, what does this even earn you? You think you're some kind of professional or something? Why are you even doing all this? You're only going to be with me for one day anyway. Whoa, Kazuyukun, what's gotten into you? We're going to be splitting up in another few hours. What's the point of treating me like this? Let's get out of here, okay? I feel so stupid, but I finally said it. If you don't even like all the guys you see, then stop pretending to be their girlfriend. <laughs> Bro. You paid for this. He paid for this. This is her job and he paid for this. <laughs> Not in front of the fish. He should just marry a fish. <sighs> Look. What was with that little hissy fit? What are you stupid screaming at me in public like that? Everyone was watching us. Huh? What is your deal today even? Asking if I feel empty and stuff. Calling me some girl. Are you really that dumb? It's called a rental girlfriend service. That's the way this works. Get his ass. Get his fucking ass, Terezo. And you're the one paying me for my time. You saw the agree to terms and continue button, and you hit it right. And why the hell did you give me just one star last week? Did I do something weird to you or what? You made my score go down three-tenths of a point. What are you going to do about that? Look, I've got nothing but five stars so far, and I'm proud of that. I've never phoned it in on any of my dates before. I bought a book about fish just for this date, and I don't even care about them. <laughs> oh, she's going in. My queen. Chorizo. Chorizo. Our queen. She's fucking getting his ass. There it is. It's the real her. Chorizo Mizuhara. Ugh. I can't believe this. Another one-star review, then. Thanks for destroying my career. Congrats. What's with her? She's so intense in real life. That lovable, modest girl from before is gone. Was that just an act? I mean, yeah, but... But all I can say is that it's all my fault. She's right. What a feminist icon. <laughs> feminist icon Kazuya? She doesn't even care about the fish, bro! He doesn't even care about the fish. Hold on. I gotta I gotta restock on some of my some of my soju. That little rant that Chorizo went on killed my throat. And I don't need to lose my voice again. 
I'm staying hydrated with soju, guys. I will say I'm cutting it with, uh, with, uh, so Soleil. Soleil? I don't know. He's just giving her constructive criticism, of course. We love a short feminist king. Four pages into the redemption arc. So what? You want to keep going? You still have time left. Because I'll keep it up if you want me to. That was his phone buzzing. Uh, hello? What? No way! Are you serious? Hey, we're still talking. Alright. Yeah, okay. My grandmother's in the hospital! What? I gotta go see her. Sorry! Wait! You still have time left! You people are carrying on far too much. You didn't have to bring the whole family here just because I fainted. We're worried about you, Mother. That's the only body you have, you know. She's right, Mom. You have to realize you're older now. We have our store to worry about. This isn't our first time here. Hey, do you have the Wi-Fi password? <laughs> Mom, don't break out your phone. Want me to buy you a magazine? Oh, let me get you some soft food. Stop treating me like an old coot. You'll make me senile faster. And who's that girl over there? She was with Kazuya, so she came here with him. Girl, why are you with him? Girl, leave. He's not paying you right now. You don't need to be here. Uh, um, you're quite an attractive young woman. Are you classmates or maybe his girlfriend? <laughs> <laughs> I'm turning the mom into, uh, his name? It's Glass. George Glass. <laughs> Come on, honey. This is Kazuya. Oh, yeah. It is Kazuya. Oh, my God. His parents hate him. <laughs> Kazuya? Yes, she's my girl, my girlfriend, rental, but... What? Are, are you serious? Nice to meet you. My name is Chirizo Mizuhara. What an act. I'm so sorry to have met you under these circumstances. Was that her saying it? And then the grandma cries because she knew... That there was no way this guy was ever getting a girlfriend. I'm checking out. Huh? I can't stay here. We need to prepare a welcome party for her. Harumi-san, we need to make a fancy dinner for five people. You're right. What are you talking about, Mom? You can't leave here the day you got admitted. Nonsense. Look at the spirited young beauty Kazuya's brought in. All I can give her in here is hospital food and a drip. Plus, this is Kazuya. Kazuya, after 20 years of no women in his life. <laughs> it's Kazuya we're talking about. That is a beautiful reaction image. Love that. Kazuya. Imagine you get a girlfriend and your family sobs because they are so happy for you. I would be devastated. <laughs> Throwing a party <laughs> the second your grandson gets a girlfriend. <laughs> it's all right. A lot of clients want to introduce me to their families. They do? My grandma, you know, this is her third trip to the hospital. You wouldn't guess, huh? Ugh, I have acid reflux. Oh? Her last stint was a long one. I guess we can't be too optimistic. The whole family's really worried about her. My family runs this place. Nagomi Liquors. Nagami Liquors. My granddad started it, and Mom and Dad took it over from him. When Granddad died, Grandma took it on all his debt, strapped my dad to her back, and kept the store open by herself. Grandma's a boss. What is this? What is that angle? It's quite an angle. So in our family, Grandma, well, she's kind of like a god to us. And it's kind of her dream for me to get a decent girlfriend before she dies. 
I've always gotten along with her, and I'd like to make that dream come true for her while I still can. You're still my girlfriend, right? I had a girlfriend for about a month. I asked if she would meet my grandma, and she said no. Can't blame her. She wound up dumping me, and I was just so upset. I wound up renting you. Pretty lame, huh? Like a rabbit. All alone in its cage. <laughs> what? <laughs> what does that mean? Like a rabbit. All alone in his cage. Despite all my rage, I'm still just a rabbit in a cage. Everybody's lonely sometimes. A lot of people can hide it as all. They use work or romance as a way to fill the holes in their hearts. But what are you going to do? You're in trouble now, telling a lie like that. You going to rent me every time? I can't. The money for one. But don't worry. I know they'll find out soon enough. I won't keep relying on you to keep this up. I kept thinking about my ex all day today anyways. So this was worth it to me. Now I know how much I liked her. I can't really let her go yet, but I gotta pick myself back up. I'll say sorry to Grandma, and someday I'll bring a real girlfriend along. From now on, I gotta step up and do something. After all, I can't rent a real me to play myself. Fucking words of wisdom. Thank you, Kyle, for the donation. Sorry, I've been trying to keep up with the chat, and <laughs> you know, I gotta, <laughs> I gotta make sure that I'm reading at the same time. Hell yeah! This is my girl. Fucking get his ass! She's ripping him to shreds, smacking the shit out of him. Dude, just yaps. <laughs> oh my gosh. Ow! What the hell? That was so stupid. Can you not get me involved in your self-absorbed narcissism? No wonder you yelled at me at the aquarium. You're the one playing make-believe with dudes. Oh, wait. He said that. You're the one make playing make-believe with dudes. That's my job, and I'm proud of it. That's business. But you know, I can see why you want to make your family happy. If you start feeling like a lonely rabbit in a cage again, call me. Rent a new me. <laughs> you nailed the don't worry. That's exactly how these guys speak. Uh, and then he smiled after getting slapped. I don't think I'll see Chorizo Mizuhara again. We got an obligatory shower scene. I won't rely on her anymore. Aw, he gave her five stars and said super satisfied. She's cute, dressed well, and has tons of style. Best girlfriend ever. Every single one of those things only had to do with her appearance. She's cute. She's dressed well and has a lot of style. And I have nothing else nice to say for her. Haha, <laughs> <laughs> ha, you dummy. Time to put an end to this pretend dating. This is my new beginning. What a start to my broke but optimistic college life. Hey, Kazuchin, how many times you jerk it yesterday? <laughs> what is with the... How many times you jerk it yesterday? This is how bros talk. The start of a life full of regret. Mm, three times, man. <laughs> what is this series? What is it? The life of a virgin. The life of a virgin. The life of a virgin. Uh, end?
What is this? What does that mean? Oh! <laughs> I didn't really, I didn't realize this was a double spread. And so I just read this and I just go, uh, end? <laughs> it was like the end of the chapter. <laughs> Uh, end? <laughs> uh, end? <laughs> That's my Davinky. <laughs> uh, end is my Davinky. What? Uh. Sorry if I scared you guys with that scream. That was her screaming. Um, am I on chapter two? Chapter two, guys! Let's go! Three more volumes to go! I'm not even 40 minutes in! There's no way I'm stopping reading! I can't stop this! The train's already on the tracks, baby. Already drunk, that could be. <laughs> <coughs> Why is he seriously answering his friends? You know, everyone's gotta have their trashy manga. What's the ebook reader? It is a Kobo. K O B O. All this time, it was only chapter one. But now we're on chapter two. And they just met. Huh? What? Ah! Ah! Do you know her, Kazuya? Uh, no, 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 no. Who's that? She's in the humanities, Ichihara, I think. Does she even go to this school? Yeah, she doesn't really stand out. So what's up? That was kind of freaky. How do you know her? Huh? I, I can't tell him the truth. No, uh, uh, maybe it was someone else. Huh? Way to disappoint me. Acting like you know every girl in school. What a virgin. You watch too many rom-coms. I am not. Dude, you just said you were. What's going on? She felt like someone, somebody different. With, what with that completely unremarkable look? But I'm sure of it. That was Chorizo Mizuhara, my rented girlfriend. Roll credits. Thank you for the donation, guys. You know what? Before we start chapter two, I just want to remind you all that we are donating to the PCRF, the Palestine Children's Relief Fund. They provide free medical care to thousands of injured and ill children yearly who lack local access to care within the local healthcare system. So, I would very much appreciate it if you guys could donate to the PCRF. Thank you very much. And we will go in to the next chapter. But Ichihara in humanities? So Teresa was going to my college this whole time? Hiding her rental girlfriend career? <coughs> oh god. Doing his voice, it hurts so bad. His voice is a nightmare on my throat. Um, unfortunately, I can't keep track of the donations, so if you guys could let me know um, where we're at. It should be, like, uh like down here somewhere um because i only can see the chat right now thank you guys for donating i really appreciate it uh that's too much of a coincidence it could be just a look like uh she grabs him huh don't you dare tell anyone huh what you don't know anything about me. We don't have any kind of relationship. You got it? I'm keeping my part-time job under wraps. Got a problem with that? I bet you can guess why. I don't need haters like you spreading rumors about me. I happen to like that job a lot, and I don't want to have to quit because of you. It was her. 
Her clothes and makeup are all different, but it's Chorizo Mizuhara. <laughs> Swear you won't say anything. Me and you are nothing. Okay, okay, okay. Ugh, why did you have to be in this school? I made sure never to date around campus. <laughs> oh, God. <laughs> <clears throat> I made sure never to date around campus. Now it's pointless. Why should I care? You're the only one. Wait, you're the one who signed up for that job. Don't raise your voice. People will hear you. You raised yours first. Look, you're a pain to have around. If you breathe a word of it, I'll make you pay. I wish I never dated you in the first place. What? Weren't you the rabbit who hired because you were dumped and lonely? Goodbye. I just pray you never hit the agree and continue button again. Yeesh. She's so self-centered. I hate this guy. Stay hydrated. Stay hydrated, you say. I got some soju right here. I will take some of my LaCroix. Wrecking my throat. Where's the girl from before? The sweet, lovable one. This girl, she's not lovable. He didn't say that, but he may as well have. Chorizo Mizuhara, I'm never gonna hire you again. Uh -uh. That was his phone buzzing. Yeah, a video call. Uh, hello? Oh, Kazuya. That's not what I made the grandma sound like, but she's gonna sound like that now. Oh, Kazuya. It finally connected. You're free now. I'm on the hospital net. This place is stuck in the 2000s. And I have to pay 980 a month for pocket Wi-Fi. Gotta tell Grandma the truth. Um, Grandma, so Kazuya is Princess Chorizo coming to see me Wednesday with the rest of the family? Oh, uh, I don't know what her plans are. I told all the ladies here that my grandson's got a girlfriend, a pretty one too, and they're all begging to see her. You told them? Oh, but her, oh, hmm. Oh, but have you heard of this new phone game, Hot and Steamy Bathhouse Babes? There's this girl in it, Ozen, and she looks like Princess Chorizo. I'm counting the days until I see Princess Chorizo, but in the meantime, I'm blowing tons of cash on this. This grandma's a streamer. Gamer, gamer grandma. With my limited English listening abilities, I don't even know what's happening, but I love the voice acting. <coughs> I'm surprised you guys all like the uh, tablet. Yeah, it's a Kobo Libra 2. I really liked it when I was using it for uh, reading articles. So, uh, where was I? I'm looking forward to it. I'm sorry. I need to rate you one more time. Huh? Is something wrong with you? I know, this is insane, but I'm visiting my grandma Wednesday and she's insisting on seeing you again. Are you serious? Just say no to her. I can't. When I was young, she was hospitalized and the family always visited her on Wednesdays. My dad will be so pissed and grandma looks so lonely to me. This is like a pack forged in blood. Besides, she really likes you. Seeing her happy like that, I can't just tell her it's a lie, so, so please. I'm sorry, but I can't. I can't get too involved in my clients' private lives. That's a company rule. Oh, yeah, true. But can, can you really turn me down? What? Are you blackmailing me? That's so awful. Please, I'm at the end of my rope here. You're the worst! How could I have let this happen? I should have read the student list more carefully. All right, just this once. I'll leave a shift open, but don't try anything weird with me. It'll be just another day on the job, got it? Okay, totally fine. And after that, this is over. Don't say a thing about my work, and don't talk to me on campus ever again. Mm, got it, you're so mean. 
Good. We have a deal. This girl just needs to wreck his ass. Yeah, he's this dude has some issues with uh, with trauma dumping on the her. <clears throat> a diamond in a rough with di what? A diamond in the rough with diamond. Oh, sorry. I Wow, so you can set up a detailed date plan and even the lunch menu in advance, huh? The fresh class is 5,000 yen an hour? With transport and food, that'll be over 20,000 yen. That's heavy. The hospital visit won't fill the time. We can hit a cafe later. Gotta use my investment. Sounds good. Looking forward to it. Sigh. Sounds good. Looking forward to it. Damn it! Why am I so worked up? You know how evil she is. She's evil. She's evil. Not him! Talk about selfish. Who knows how she's gonna act. The next day. Kazuya kun! Whoa, is that girl a celebrity or something? I'm jealous of her BF. So shameless to say, but she is so damn cute! Well, shall we? Okay. Women can sure transform, can't they? Between her cute hair and her style, she really is like an idol. If it wasn't for this rental girlfriend thing, I'd never be walking next to someone like her. A diamond in the rough. What? What's going on with me? I hate him. I hate him so much. Someone save, someone save Chorizo. Get my girl Chorizo out of here. She doesn't deserve this. She's cute. Yep, it's all here. This part's always scary. Okay, we're off to the hospital. Hmm, what's up? Uh, nothing. Scared of hospitals. Huh? Kinoshita-san! Mom, wait! Princess! Grandma! Grandma! It's so hard to tell who's talking sometimes. <laughs> <coughs> What's going on here? I was so anxious, I thought you were just a mirage. I wanted a girl for my grandson so bad, I thought I dreamed it all up. She's not wrong. We're heading home, Mom. Fine, I'll just chat with the princess. Walk her home later, Kazuya. You can stay with us anytime. Thank you very much. By the way, have you guys had sex yet? Grandma! What the shit, Grandma? <laughs> Grandma, that's what we're talking- that- that's what we're talking about? Don't be bashful, Kazuya. That's how young people are these days. All my followers do it all the time. Who are your followers, Grandma? <laughs> your physical chemistry is key if you get married. You're my only heir, Kazuya. Uh, marriage, way too soon. She has no idea that I'm paying for this. How could I be so dumb? Kazuya-san and I have discussed it. Like, we want to do it right. I know he's your precious grandson, so I wanted to obtain your permission first. Grandma! Grandma to my boyfriend. Grandma to my boyfriend, can I please have sex with your grandson? Please, Grandma to my boyfriend. <laughs> <laughs> Grandma, I'm sitting you down today because I have a very important question to ask you. Can I have sex with your grandson? <laughs> Oh my god. What the hell is with her? How do rent-a-girlfriends put up with it? Oh, right. Wait one moment. I'll bring the other ladies in here. Ugh, okay. Hey, what's the deal with that? Other ladies? Yeah, I guess she's been telling them that I've 
got a girlfriend. What? Oh, crap. What are we going to do? Huh? Why are you so worked up? She's in here, too. My, my grandmother. She's been admitted here, too, to this hospital. There is way too much coincidence. The only reason these two are being set up together is because somehow, some way, literally every single thing is the same about them. Their grandmas are in the same hospital. They go to the same school. What? This is like an insane... She can't escape this guy. Because she... It, everything is the same for them. Uh, what? What? You didn't say that last time. I didn't think I'd be back here again. I haven't told her about my job yet. That's serious trouble. When she sees you, my grandma will know I'm tricking her. Yeah, that's why I said, oh crap. I gotta get out of here. Oh, uh, wait. Come on, girls. Over here. Oh, God. Ugh. I'm only on chapter two. It took me an hour to read two chapters. I'm not even done with this chapter yet. Ah, oh, shit, they're here. An empty room? They're gone. They were here just a moment ago. It's true, they were. We don't, we don't doubt you, Kinoshita-san. They can't be too far away. Let's go find them, ladies. I'll look over there. Someone watch the elevators. I feel kind of like a detective. Stupid granny dra dragnet. I don't know what that means. What does that mean? Someone tell me what dragnet is? Is that... I don't know what that means. Uh, they'll find us sooner or later in here. What do we do? Jump out the window? Like, make a rope from the curtains? We're on the fifth floor. We'd fall halfway... Oh, wait. We're on the fifth floor. We'd fall halfway down and die. We'll have to leave separately. You leave first, and then I'll go outside while you distract them. Will that really work? We have no other choice. Did you check out room 50 yet? That's empty, isn't it? Such a pity about Fujisan. Oh, someone died. Thank you for donations, chat. Uh, shit, they're here. Just, just follow me. Da! Hmm? Not here. Dude. <sighs> oh boy. Dude, what are you... Don't talk, dumbass. They'll find us. Yeah, but... D down there. D down there. Oh. oh, I can't get close. I can't even get close to a girl without getting down there. Down there! Down there! Kazuya, Princess Chizuru, this is a much bigger problem for me! Stop that! What are you thinking? I can't! It's the natural reaction of a 20 year old virgin! Get that thing down right now! <laughs> I told you, I can't! Keep it up and I'll inform the office. Dude, quit moving. You'll make it worse. No roaming. I'm fucking so serious. Oh my god. Uh, hmm? Um, are you alright? All, all clean here, madam! Uh, sorry to bother you. Have you seen a young couple around here? They, uh, said they were leaving, madam. What? Oh, I owe you one, sir. <coughs> oh goodness, my throat!
pee pee jokes are the staple of every chapter. <laughs> yes, welcome to anyone who joined just now when the guy got a boner. Um, I think they're gone. Yeah. This close to her. Oh crap. She's so thin and soft. Uh, no, this is actually a Kobo. Kobo Libra 2 is what it's called. Her heart's beating fast through the valley of the... S okay. I'm gonna read this line, guys. And just know, it pains me as much as it pains you. Her heart's beating hard through the valley of her supple breasts. Mizuhara, you're so cute. Oh, man. The heat. My mind's a blank. Right now, at this very moment, she's my girlfriend, isn't she? Her supple breasts. Oh, her supple breasts. <laughs> yeah! What the hell? I'll sue you. I'll take you to court. I told you I'm a rental girlfriend. You think we're like that? It ain't gonna happen in a million years. Ch chorizo? Chorizo? G grandma What is it, Ichino Sesan? Ah, Kazuya. Huh? This is Kaz Kazuya kun. So <coughs> So this girlfriend was Chorizo? Huh? So Chorizo is my granddaughter. What? Your granddaughter? They they found out. I can't cause her any more trouble. Um I'm sorry, Grandma. To tell the truth, I don't actually Oh wow, so you're her you're why can't I read? Wow, so your grandmother and mine know each other, Kazuya-san? Mizuhara? Boy, small world, huh? Maybe it's destiny. Ah ha ha ha! Ha ha ha! Ha ha ha! Ha ha ha! She starts crying. <laughs> Granny turned into Mickey Mouse. Oops! <laughs> what a surprise! I can't believe Princess Teresa was your granddaughter! Me either. Imagine Kazuya-kun seeing my little girl. But it makes sense. You must have given that radiant beauty her hot bod. Grandma. I'm starting to see why this guy turned out this way. Grandma's a weirdo, too. Oh, Kanishita-san. I'm just glad she's found such a fine young lad. We'll be seeing a lot of each other now. Oh, indeed. Oh, God, they're working together now. No time left for the cafe, huh? No, for the better. Sorry I had to make you lie like that. Ah, uh, it's my fault for keeping it a secret. Can we just say that we've broken up? That's the best solution. Y yeah, I think so. I had no idea your grandmother was in the hospital. You really got me out of a jam there. So, uh, sorry, and th thanks. I hope you don't hate me or whatever. I'm not saying this because I hate you. I just want to make my family happy too. But right now, I can't afford to quit this job. Uh, Mizuhara. I'm sure you'll find yourself a wonderful girlfriend. I don't think he will. This guy doesn't... This guy shouldn't have a girlfriend. He needs to go to therapy. He needs to work some stuff out. Spoiler, they keep lying for longer than you would expect. I, um, am not surprised, because how in the world would this series have, like, 23 volumes if they weren't lying for so long? With that, she gave me a smile and see you, said see you, and left. She had to lie to her own grandmother, but doing that saved mine and... Me too. Even with trash like me, she was a pro to the end. If I had five million yen, I'd rent her every day. Five stars. Haha, <laughs> you dumbass. I got class first thing tomorrow. I'll need to get up early. I'll keep my promise. I can't bother her anymore. I doubt we'll ever talk at school again. Now, I can finally... Put an end to this. 
off I go. My days with my girlfriend, Chizuru. My life is a girl f virgin girlfriend renter. Except for the virgin part. It's all over. What? So he's not a virgin? Is he a virgin or not? Stop it! Why? Why? They can't... They can't live next to each other. That makes no sense. Stop it. This poor woman. Everything in her life. Is making her be around this man. Save her. Save Chorizo. She didn't. She doesn't deserve this. She doesn't deserve this. Look at her. She's cute. She's actually a cute girl. She seems nice. She didn't trauma dump about her grandma. She didn't say, oh, my grandma's in the hospital too. Only he did that. Because she's a professional. Oh my god. Hashtag free chorizo. Hashtag free chorizo from this endless nightmare that she continually lives in. I feel like the only reason they probably fall in love is because she's in a fucking... What do they call it? When, like, you fall in love with your kidnapper? I feel like he's kidnapped her. And she's, like, had no choice but to fall in love with him. This poor girl. This poor, poor, poor girl. Look at her. She's cute. I like this outfit. This is a cute outfit. She looks cute here. Someone save her. Stockholm Syndrome. Thank you. Yes. She has Stockholm Syndrome. I think that is- <laughs> I like how my whole chat right now is just Stockholm Syndrome. <laughs> oh my god. It is a hostage situation. Okay, before I go on to the third chapter, I'm going to take a quick bathroom break. So, um, everyone enjoy my loading screen. I will be back in like five minutes i'll be back by like 8 12 we'll say brb everyone
Oops. Oops. Can you guys hear me now? <laughs> I think I I think I'm I think I'm on. I think we're good. Since there's a little delay in the chat. Okay. Uh, yeah. Okay. <laughs> I forgot. I, I didn't turn my, my mic back on and I forgot. <laughs> <clears throat> anyway, I think all I said was that I refilled my soju. So cheers to anyone else who has, uh, Cheers to anyone else who has some alcohol with them to get through this uh, beautiful, beautiful series. Just truly, um, truly a treat. We're at 405. Hell yeah. Let's go, guys. Um, I guess since we are there once again. Uh, we are donating to the PCRF today. While I read, rent a girlfriend. Uh, PCRF is the Palestine's Children Relief Fund, which provides free medical care to thousands of injured and ill children yearly who lack local care access uh, within the local health care system. So if you guys could help out if you have the means to donate, that'd be greatly appreciated. All right, guys. Chapter three. Let's go. <sighs> what? Why are you here at Royal Hills Narima? You live in my building? You have to be kidding me. <laughs> Girl just slammed her door and ran away. <laughs> Whoa, wait, Mizuhara-san, you're Mizuhara-san, right? Oh, I mean, Ichinose-san? What a small world, huh? Why are you here? Uh, my apartment's next door. I mean, why are you living here? How do I answer that? I've been here since April. I will not interact with you! <laughs> no meddling, no prying into my life! <laughs> Jeez, I'm not a stalker. Selfish as always. I can't believe it's the same girl. But she really lives here. Chorizu Mizuhara in the next room over. Why does he say her full name so often? Why does he always say her full name? It's weird. Uh, I wanted to see... I wanted to see Princess Chorizo, so I got permission to go out. I'm headed for your apartment. You have off today, right? Just a little bit of time is fine, so you can set it up for me. Uh, Grandma's coming here? Now what? Better put the porn mags in the closet. Should I buy some food? She wants to see Mizuhara. For real? If I tell her in here that we broke up, she'd scream at me. What if the shock makes her burst into tears? What then? Please, I need you to be my girlfriend one more time. What? That's not funny. Why me? You promised to stop talking to me. Yeah, just at school. Don't weasel out of it. Please, my my grandma. Please, my grandma. My grandma. I'm going to start reading for him. This is a little whiny little fucking shitbag. <laughs> He's never known a woman well enough to know her full name. Oh my god. <laughs> Girl, just say no. <laughs> That's not her problem. Uh, where was I? Weren't you gonna say we broke up? I wasn't ready to yet. What? That's pathetic. You haven't either. I, I haven't had the chance. Section 3.3, forcing the talent to enter your house, vehicle, or other private space is prohibited. You're an adult. You know what that means? You ha you tell a lie. You have to come clean. Ugh. The more you put it off, the more childish you get. Plus, I told you, I can't get involved in private things. 
They'd fire me if they heard I took off work, took work off the books. Uh, come on, they'd never know. How could they? You monster! That's not the issue. Also, I'm gonna spend a day in here writing this essay, so goodbye and don't come back. Let this girl do her homework. She has homework. She's in college too. She's doing this job so she can pay for college and so she could go to college. She needs to go to college. She wants an education, unlike you apparently, who never goes to school. Right, Kazuya, whip up some tea for me. Whoa, you got here fast. Gotta just get this over with. But how? What a pigsty you live in. This is not the room of someone with a girlfriend. Oh, is Princess Chorizo here yet? She's free, right? Uh, no, 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 uh, she, she, she's at work, like a, like a sudden call in. Will she make it here? Mm. Will she make it here? Boy, I ho sure hope, mm. I don't know what that means. I don't, I don't know what I'm reading right now. Cheers. <laughs> Put the porn mags in the closet. That's what he says. Thank you for the donations. Um, uh, no, 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 wait, no, I was already there. Well, I'll be here till tonight. Why don't I tidy up? She'll be here all day. There's no way I can go talk to Mizuhara right now. What the hell should I do? First, the closets. N no, they're okay. Ah ha ha ha! Look at how happy Osen is! Thank you, Nagomi-san. Thank you. Oh. Look, she has Princess Chorizo's eyes! Oh, you like that, hmm? <laughs> Let me buy you a fall foliage kimono! I don't know who she's talking to. So, is Princess Chorizo done yet? Huh? Boy, uh, who knows? Why don't you try calling? Huh? Call? You have to know it, right? Her number? Uh, yeah, her number. Uh, of course I do. I only know her work line ID and her boss monitors that. Hello? Yeah, my grandma's here. How is it? Busy? Right, okay. <laughs> I got a package for ya. Please, just one minute! Ten seconds even! Give me a break! What are you doing?! I'm serious, my grandma's super excited to see you! She's gonna move into my place if this keeps up. Yeah, because you won't tell her we broke up. Go away, I'm gonna call the cops. I'll buy you some desserts at the store! Ow! Dude! I hate him! I hate this guy! Why does he suck? He falls on her like he falls in her, uh, he falls on her like head to pussy. This apartment is such a piece of crap. I told the super to get this chain fixed. Get out. I'm really going to call the police. Uh, calm down. I didn't mean to. Aren't you supposed to help your neighbor? Not if he's a promise breaking. Oh, wait. Not if he's a promise breaking terrorist. Please, think of it as a favor. We've already dated, haven't we? Don't you have any empathy? <laughs> Why? He's the worst person on earth. He's horrible. I told you I'm a renter girlfriend. Okay. And then she kicks him. And he deserves it. She should be kicking him more often. Yes, uh, she should have called the cops. She should have called the cops as soon as he he came up to the door. <laughs> Kazuya, how long are you talking to her? Oh, y yeah, cool. Work's keeping you late, huh? That sucks. How dare you loiter in the apartment hallway? Just get inside. I'm sorry, I only have frozen food in here. 
I didn't expect much. Uh, Grandma looks so lonely, not getting to see Mizuhara. What am I supposed to do? You tell a lie. You have to come clean. The more you put it off, the more childish you get. Oh, uh, well, here, here we go. Um, Grandma, we, uh, we need, we need to talk. Uh, and then we cut to Mizuhara and her apartment. So is she gone yet? You split up, didn't you? Oh, wait. You split up, didn't you? What? Grandma? You think I don't notice when my grandson changes? She must have gotten sick of your depravity. <laughs> <laughs> oh my fucking god. I have never met a family who hates someone in their family more than they hate this guy. This family hates him. Why does he love his grandma so much when they hate him? They hate him so much. She must have gotten sick of your depravity. I can picture it well enough. Just look at this place. You couldn't tell me the truth, so you tried to keep up appearances. Grandma, where's your dignity as heir to the Kidushitas? You're not angry? You still care about me? And Mizuhara? Ever since you were young, you never once were popular with girls. Not even once. Not a single time. Uh-huh. You kept bringing your filthy male friends home. Sometimes I doubted I'd ever see a woman who liked you. <laughs> How could I be angry at that woman who loved you? And who let me indulge in this wonderful fantasy, like a messenger from heaven. Yeah, I'm so stupid. No way a girl like Mizuhara would hang with me for free. All these coincidences got me too full of myself, but it's all an illusion. Chorizo Mizuhara is a rental girlfriend, and it's all an act. Grandma, I'm sorry. I... I... Um, excuse me? Sorry, I'm late. I got held up cooking this. Girl, stop feeling bad for him. There's no reason to. You don't need to feel bad for him. Because the guy is already bad himself. You don't have to feel bad because he's a bad person. Someone save her. Save my girl, Chorizo. Save my girl, Chorizo. Mizuhara? Why, why are you here? What do you mean, Kazuya-san? You contacted me a million times since this morning. You know I'd be willing to go anywhere for your grandma. P Princess. Princess Jesu Chorizo. I almost said her name the right way. How could I? So glad to see you, Chizuru-san, and I believed in you. I knew you didn't abandon Kazuya. He'll never have another love in his whole life. <laughs> what were you trying to tell me just now? My princess is right here. Trash. Good for nothing. Good for nothing trash. Trash. He's the trash man. He just goes around and he throws trash everywhere. <laughs> oh, God. Do your essay, Chorizo. Oh my god! Hi, Patton Taylor, if this is the Patton Taylor that I know. Hold on. Zach says hi, too. Sorry, I had to go double check and see if Zach knew. You get to see the absolute chaos that is happening right now. Anyway, back to back to rent a girlfriend. Back to rent a girlfriend. <sighs> okay, it's all right, Grandma. And then she glares at him. Thank you. Just a little more. What? She stuck out of the hospital. Yep, the nurses were so worried. 
Kazuya, make sure Princess Chorizo gets home safe. You're gonna get married, I'm sure of it. I hope they don't. Uh, help me, Kazuya! Stop treating me like an old woman! Well, you are one! <laughs> Mizuhara, is it me, or did she look so lonely just now? Mizuhara, here. Forget about it. It's not at this- not at this point. I can't report this anyway. No. Huh? I want to rent you next week, but you don't have to come. With everything today, you couldn't write that report, could you? So let me pay for you that day. You visit her every Wednesday, and that's it, right? Huh? Yeah. And no other days, right? Uh, right! No meddling, and no prying, and we're total strangers on campus, too. Don't look me up, don't approach me, don't talk to me. The three don'ts of staying away. If you contact me, do it via the site. Me, Mizuhara? If it's just for an hour, then I'll let you rent me for an hour every Wednesday. Don't, girl. Girl, you're better than this. You don't need to do this, Chorizo. Chorizo Miyazuhara, you can't fix him. You can't fix him. I promise. Thank you, Future Skeleton, for donating. 20 more to go! Let's go, baby! If we hit the $500 mark, I think, since I said I would read one more volume, that I could split it up into two volumes and I'll just do this another night. So I could do the two volumes today and then two volumes next time. Let's go! Thank you, Sid! I think we just hit 500 then. Let's go! Yeah! Thank you guys so much. Um, now I'm trying to think if there's like another goal I could um have for us. You guys put some suggestions for other goals if we want to keep going, or like other rewards for for a goal. Unless I keep adding more volumes, in which case I guess I could do it, but like. Mizuhara, both our grandmas are in there. We can't worry them until they're discharged. I'm not doing this for you. It's for our grandparents, so don't get the wrong idea. And so we set off, clinging to a thin lifeline called renting. Every Wednesday, just an hour. As, a, as we attempt to cross the sweet, sweet bridge of love, I need you to be my girlfriend. My name is Kazuya Kinoshita, age 20. I'm a first year at college in Tokyo. My rental girlfriend, Chorizo Mizuhara, is posing as my real GF to my family. Not that it makes much difference to my life, sexual or otherwise. Stop it! No! This guy had another fucking daydream about getting cocked! Stop it! <laughs> I don't need this guy to get daydreams of being cucked every chapter. Every chapter. Hold on. I don't know if I should show that on YouTube, but... Every chapter! He's like, oh, I'm getting cucked by this girl who's not my girlfriend anymore. I defend a lot of controversial <laughs> MCs, but there is not a single defense for this guy. Uh, yeah, I, I also think the author might have a fetish. Oh, okay, so he gets cucked in a dream again. Mommy-chan! I'm still firmly stuck in, stuck in life as a single virgin. First period... 
brand management. Oh. I hate this art. Why is she doing that? Hold on. Let me see if I can... Let me see if I can recreate this. I can't. What the fuck? <laughs> Why is she... She's so bent. She broke her back for that. Giving Kardashian realness. So true. We are in chapter four. I'm pretty sure chapter four is the last chapter of this volume, I think. All right. And he runs into Mommy Chan. Oh, Kazuya. Kazukun. Hold on. How do we think Mommy Chan would sound? Would she sound like this? I feel like this is too close to Terizo's, like, dating voice. Oh! <laughs> <laughs> oh, hey, Kazukun. Uh, Mommy Chan. Whoa, the first time since we split. She sure is cute. When you see her up her close, her sparkling eyes, her fluffy hair. I want to pet it. Come on, ask her. Ask her why she blocks you on Twitter! <laughs> Ask her why she blocked you on Twitter. <laughs> oh my god. A valley girl? Give her the Batman voice! Oh my god. Shivam, you want to kill my voice. <laughs> Alright, I'll try. The play it dumb. You're so funny, blocking me and all. No, if it wasn't a joke, it'd kill me. The deadpan. Why did you block me? Do you hate me? That's so shitty, I can't pick a fight with her. What am I, a stalker? Why are you standing there, Kazukun? Oh, oh my god, I did his voice wrong. Oh, sorry. Bro. Stop it! Stop staring her! Stop! Get away. Find help. See ya. Okay. Officer, officer, this guy has been staring at his ex's thighs all morning. Virgins like you go around camp is looking for things to whack it to later, huh? The wild virgin on the hunt. Shut up! Stop treating me like a monkey in heat! Bro, you are! Well, he may be right. I keep having dreams about getting cucked and all. Yeah, Mommy Chan's a nice girl, huh? Her and you lasting a month was a miracle. She's got cute legs and tons of girly power. And her looks, well, you know. I like how she keeps it light, too. I bet she'd treat you well in bed, huh? Stop mentally addressing her! She's my ex! Like you have any right to stop me? What? M Mizuhara? I'm getting all of the voices mixed up now. <laughs> <laughs> I need stats on how many times Virgin has said in this manga. I need it too, honestly. This is insane. For like four chapters, I'm not even done with the first volume. Her? Forget it. She'd be a dead fish. In bed, I bet she'd get all serious and freeze up. No fun at all. Just a face in the crowd? Great, great for a virgin like you. <laughs> but just forget about Mommy-chan, okay? As your friend since kindergarten, let me tell you, she's out of your league. That's what a real friend would say. Real friends would tell their friends that girls wouldn't like them. I think the better thing to say would just be, um, Hey, friend, you're kind of a misogynist. So, uh, you might not get a girlfriend that way. You might want to fix your attitude, brother. 
Uh, was that your ex? Was that your ex? I don't think he's given up. Yeah, those scary eyes. Oh, yeah. Ha oh, ha ha, you player. He's nothing to you now. Uh, yeah. <laughs> Shivam, I'm so mad that you made me do the Batman voice for this. <laughs> oh, hey, Kazu-chan. <laughs> no way, kazu <laughs> Dude, no, 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 stop it, stop it, stop it, bro, if you fucking get your boner out one more time, I do not want to have to see this guy jerk it one more time. <sighs> uh, yeah. Huh? Anyone? M Mizuhara? What are you doing? It's time to go to the hospital. Uh, uh, oh, it's that time already? I thought it was jerking it time. Goodness. I got a drinking problem. Guys, I can't do this. Yeah, still volume one, by the way. I've I've been streaming for two hours. I've been streaming for almost two hours and it's only the first volume. <laughs> Guys. <laughs> uh. I want to meet up outside from now on, okay? I'll get fired if they find out I'm meeting you at home. I told you I'm proud of my five star reviews, so no palling around. I'm when I'm your girlfriend, it'll just be It'll be just like always, and you don't need to go easy on the post-date review. Those are my, for my sake. Cool as always, business-like. So, can you pay me now? It's easier for us to get that out of the way first. Oh, uh, right. This is kind of her. Today's invoice, base fee, 5,000 yen. Naming fee, fresh class, 5,000 yen. Transport, 10,000, sorry, 2,000 yen. Total, 12,000 yen. Dude, he doesn't have a job. He doesn't have a job. Someone... I'm dying. Hi, Aaron. Hi, Drew. Oh my god. Thank you for the donations. I am doing this for the PCRF. This is how I keep myself going. We are doing this for the PCRF. If you guys have the means, please donate. We are helping people in need. And that is what we were doing it for. Thank you, Shivam. Uh, Shivam hasn't posted in too long, but if you guys don't follow Shivam, highly recommend. Great videos. Thank you, card captors. Uh, okay, where am I? And in exchange, think of me as your girlfriend for the next hour. Uh, oh wait, whoops, went the wrong way. Okay, ready to go, Kazuya-kun. Hey, uh, can I hold your hand? Wh what? Uh, okay. It's all an act, it's all an act. I notice this every time. All these guys' eyes when I walk with her. Which, I mean, 
I get it. She's beautiful. You don't see girls like her every day. Too bad every girl around me is out of my league. Kazuya? What? What are you up to, Kazuya? Why them? Uh, seeing my grandma. Oh, the hospital's near here, right? Why here in Itabashi? Wait, you and that girl, y you were holding hands? Oh, crap. D do they know it's a Chino say? Sorry, this guy's an ignorant buffoon. He's not interested in joining your cult. <laughs> only way this guy would be going anywhere with a hot woman if she was trying to get him to join a cult. Truly. Thank you for donating, Sunhaven. <sighs> okay. Plus, he's poor! If he oh, wait. Hold on. This guy was a surfer, dude. Uh, plus, he's poor. If you're selling him something, I'd try somewhere else. Look, Kazuya, I'm sorry you can't be popular, but you're still so young. You can have an ugly GF you want. Yeah, yeah, you don't need to spend all that as long as she's ugly. Huh? Uh, quit saying ugly. It's all right, don't worry, we're here. I can lend you 3,000 yen. The road to recovery begins when you realize you're the victim. Sad to say. Stop it. I don't need counseling. It's nothing like that. Who's the victim here? Open your eyes, damn it. Why else would you be holding hands with a grade A hottie like her? Is she a runaway or your long lost sister? Qu quit it. You're being so rude. You're being so rude to my girlfriend. This voice over? You guys better be appreciating it. I am destroying my voice right now. And I highly expect my voice to be gone tomorrow. Uh, I think I said this already. I don't know if you guys saw, but I think I put it in my comment section for my CMX video. But um, the Batman voice literally made me lose my voice for like two days afterwards. I like RIP to my voice. <laughs> this man is ashamed of the male race. <laughs> okay. Uh, girlfriend. My name's Mizuhara. It's nice to meet the friends of my wonderful boyfriend. A wonderful boyfriend? Oh, oh, oh. oh. Your, your girlfriend? Like, like going on dates and eating pancakes? Liking each other's selfies on Instagram? Uh, that kind of thing? Creating a shared lock Twitter account and posting makeout pics all like, oh no, they're looking. That kind of girlfriend? Uh, what else? How dare they? I mean, always making fun of me. This girl's like super devoted, okay? Like, whatever I say, uh, she listens. She's super devoted. Uh, she listens to everything I say. Try this on for size. It's kind of annoying at times, but she says she loves me, and I just can't say no, right? There. <laughs> I said it. That's going to fly! <laughs> My name is Teresa, and I'm just so happy to be here! <laughs> uh, thank you for donations! It is the only thing keeping me going right now. Thank you. I appreciate the kindness. <sighs> okay, hold on. Hold on. I need a drink break. Devoted means obedient. Listen, my girlfriend, my girlfriend that I buy with money, she's so obedient. Oh 
man, what the hell? This feels great. A different world. Next to me, the cutest chick in history. A raging torrent pulling ahead. And here I am. The peak of the animal hierarchy. I am so fucking alpha, bro. Oh, I'm alpha before alphas were even a thing. Get over here. D did you do it? I mean, sex, dude. Sex. No, we haven't. But we're so in love. Well done. If you gave your virginity to her, it'd be so unforgettable, your future sex life would be ruined. All other women would look like garbage. These idiots. Her? Forget it. Zero sex appeal. Uh, trust me on this one. Find an ugly girl or a prostitute. <laughs> She's the same girl. <laughs> That girl you called ugly? This hot girl's the same girl. I hate it here. Would you guys hate me if I only did one volume? I literally... <laughs> We've been streaming for almost two hours. And I'm not even done with volume one. Would you guys hate me if I only did one volume today? <laughs> Sorry, m'lady. I'm not joking. He literally said m'lady. He literally said m'lady. My name is Kibe. Why is he crying? And why my lady? I know you're busy with your date. I'd love to invite you out to the drinking party we're headed to now. A party? Drinking? Right now? Yeah, Sasano-san invited us over. Is she coming, or do you make that call? Hee <laughs> hee. The ideal wife. <laughs> this is just a misogyny speed run. This is a misogyny speed run. They were like, how, how misogynistic can we be? In one volume. <sighs> okay. So you come in, Kazuya? As a man, you don't get chances like this. You can brag all you want. It's the only reason you get a girlfriend, right? To brag to other men? Uh, for sure. We were just talking about getting some food. Sweet, let's go. You too, girl. <laughs> <laughs> they didn't even get her name. They just called her girl. Save Chorizo. Someone save Chorizo. Someone save Chorizo. Chorizo. Can we get much higher? So high. Ah, this elevator's tiny. You go up first. We'll take the stairs, m'lady. M'lady. I'm sorry. What the hell? How many more lies do you need to tell? Your hour was up long ago. I'll pay for the time. Kiba is an old friend. He knows my grandma. It's always the grandma. This guy always has an excuse. And it's always, but my grandma. Fucking get a life. Get a life, bro. You wouldn't disappoint your grandma so much if you weren't such a fucking asshole. If you could be a decent person, you would get a girlfriend in like two seconds. Just go take a fucking shower. So please, I'll tell them we broke up later. Well, let them live this fantasy for a little while, okay? There you are. This way, guys. So fast. What's with him? He's sweating. Uh, watch your step. Hello there. Sorry, you have the filthy college student escorting you. Oh, wait. No, that was Surfer Bro. 
Uh, sorry, you had the filthy college student escorting you. Why freeze it like that? This is a college party. Is she in college? Oh, I am in my first year. Uh, oh, one year younger than Kazuya. Sorry, we're late. We brought Kazuya along and his girlfriend. Huh? Oh, what's up? Kazu chan. Fuck, I keep saying chan. Kazu gun. Kazu gun. No, there's five chapters in volume one! There's another chapter! There's another chapter! There's one more chapter! There's one more chapter of volume one! I have to read more! Chapter five. <laughs> Chapter five. Chapter five. <laughs> I love Rent Girlfriend. <laughs> it's my favorite series. Oh, I just love this series. Just as a reminder to you guys, we are donating today to the PCRF. They are a very good organization that helps provide free medical care to the thousands of injured and ill children yearly who lack local care access to care within the local health care system. I feel like I said that wrong. I'm very sorry. Please donate to the PCRF if you have the means. I would very much appreciate it. They're a good cause. There are many people who are going through a very hard time right now. And you could help out. Thank you. I appreciate you all. You've been very kind this whole time. Now we will read the last chapter. I'm reading this for a good cause. I'm reading this for a good cause. <sighs> do it oh my fucking god i'll have you guys know i drank the entire soju bottle um anyone who has had soju before knows that yeah soju is quite a bit okay chapter five Okay. Hold on. How does Batman sound? Gazukun. Ma uh, mommy chan Whoa, sorry, Kazuya. I had no idea mommy chan was coming. Hey, Kazuya, want a drink? Come on in. I'll have a beer. Ah, oh, nice. So mature. Quit it. And the GF? I'll have a Shirley Temple. I'll have a little Shirley Temple. Because I'm a little girly girl. Girls have Shirley Temples. And men have beers. And non-binary people have soju. <laughs> Every Korean is non-binary now. <laughs> so then, you know, his ex said... Oh, sorry. Uh, chatter, chatter, chatter. I so, so, so want to go home. That or just disappear. Why must it be like this? The air feels so damn heavy and everyone's shutting up out of respect for Mommy-chan. Should I go to the bathroom and flee? No, if I leave Mizahara now, she'll be so pissed. She'd never talk to me again. 
So, is Mami-chan angry? I could see why. We split up less than a month ago and I have a new girlfriend. But she's the one who dumped me. What would she have to be angry about? Maybe she's a bit jealous? Maybe she's a bit jealous? She's jealous of me? Oh my god. She's jealous of me? As an envy, I guess I gotta try Soju. Soju is so good. Like, of alcohol, Soju is amazing. Um, I'm not much of an alcohol drinker. Uh, for beer, I mostly can just drink, like, Blue Moon. And then whenever summer comes around, I love the Wine and Kugel Lemon Shandies. But Soju? I could- I drank a bottle of Soju on my own. Like, I can't do that with any other alcohol. So, Soju's where it's at. Soju's where it's at. Uh, okay. C come on, guys. Lighten up. It's over. And I got a new- <laughs> I can't do the Batman voice. Uh, I have to hydrate before the Mommy John lines. Um, is it sweet? So it depends on what kind you get. My favorite is strawberry, and yes, it's a little sweet. It's kind of like if vodka tasted good. I think that's the best way to explain it. It's like if vodka tasted good. Okay. C come on guys lighten up it's over and i got a new one anyway let's just have a nice time ah uh, okay what she got a new one for real since when oh just a bit ago do we know him she got a new what a, a dog yeah right it's it's a new guy so mommy chan had one well of course she's cute and stuff Ah, oh, that's a secret. <laughs> so while I was agonizing over all of that, she was already going at it? Listen, Mami-chan, Mizuhara is a rent-a-girlfriend. I paid money for her. Funny, huh? There's nothing physical between us. She didn't come near me until I signed the terms of service. Ah, oh, what? well, what year is he? Second, I think. Oh, so our age! <laughs> <laughs> I just Arr, it's so our age <laughs> Are you two boning already, Mommy Chan? Are you two boning already, Mommy Chan? Mommy Chan? <laughs> it was ironic, Your Honor. <laughs> um Flavored soju doesn't taste like alcohol. That is very true. Um, it tastes more like juice. It's very dangerous. <laughs> to, to have soju, it's very dangerous because you think it's fine because you feel like you're just drinking juice. But then you'll end up like me reading Rent-A-Girlfriend. Hold on. We got a cat. Everyone say hi to Pongo. Big stretch. Big stretch, Pongo. Oh, lay down. Everyone say hi to Pongo. I'll give him a little virtual pet for you. Okay. Are you two boning already, Mommy-chan? Did you put your guard up because I'm a gross virgin? It's probably because you're a fucking asshole. If your guy's a flashy stud, did you do it yet? Come on, can... Wait. Come on, can we drop it? I feel bad for her, too. Why are you so blocking me, Mommy-chan? Mommy-chan! Why are you still blocking me? Mommy-chan! Uh, look, I'm, I'm having visions of you cooking! I'm getting cooked! Why? I fucking hate this guy! He is such I 
Guys, please donate to the PCRF. I would very much appreciate it if you have the means to do so. It helps a good cause. It helps people in need. Do you think God stays in heaven because he doesn't want to read Rent-A-Girlfriend? I have to get through one more chapter of this. One more chapter. One more chapter. I can... One more chapter. Oh, one more chapter. Thank you very s much, Danya. I can't even talk right now. I very much appreciate all of you who have donated and helped out tonight. Um, we will continue, but uh, I think I need a second. I think I need a second. Uh, our donation goal was 500. We have already hit that. So I will be reading another Rent-A-Girlfriend volume, just not tonight. I don't think I can read more than one volume tonight. I didn't think it would take this long. I thought I could read three volumes in one night. But apparently, three volumes is too much. And I could only read one volume. Pongo! Hold on. You guys can have some cat content. Um... Pongo, say hi. Say hi. Oh, okay. Standing up has made me realize I am a little tipsy. <laughs> I am a little tipsy. Pongo, say hello. Hi, everyone. My name's Pongo. I'm the cutest cat around. Look at what I let Colleen do to me. I let her do anything. Because they are my owner. And I love them. <laughs> All right, Pongo break. Everyone say hi to Pongo. Hello, everyone. Hello, everyone. They're so good. Pongo hates Rent-A-Girlfriend. Pongo only likes Peek. Pongo loves Basara. Okay, buddy. Uh. Thank you, the samurai, for the donation. Okay, where were we? Oh, yes! I'm imagining her getting gucked. <laughs> Uh, sure, if you want. Let's drink it away. Cheers! What school are you? Itabashi girls. Crap. I'm talking way too fast. Fleeing reality. I was worried at first, but Mizuhara's chill and so is Mami-chan. Maybe I can pull through this. Pongo! Ugh. Pongo eats his hair. Pongo. Pongo. Sorry. Pongo has a bad habit of pulling his hair out. He's got some anxiety. Just like his parents. Okay, and then he has another fucking daydream about her getting cucked. What the fuck? Two! Stop it! Leave this poor girl alone! You dated for a month. One month. 
and you have had more visions of her cucking you than you've dated at this point. I hate him. <sighs> uh, damn it, don't piss that way. <laughs> You're still wild, huh? My poor. <laughs> what is this one? <sighs> My poor, poor little Kazuya. Oh, I went the wrong way. Hold on. I'm just gonna read it like this now. I can't read it like that, actually. <laughs> Mental health check. Where's Elmo when you need him? Elmo? Someone manifest Elmo into this chat. <sighs> oh, his name is Pongo because I'm at least I'm pretty sure this is why, but um. And I didn't realize until after we adopted him, and I thought his name was just funny. But his name is Pongo because of the dog from 101 Dalmatians, the main dog. His name is Pongo. And Pongo has, like, white, white and black spots all over him because he looks like a little Dalmatian. Uh, okay. What's the shoujo rent-a-girlfriend? If we're talking about, like, trashy series... Um, maybe hot gimmick? Okay, Mizu Mizuhara and Mami-chan are sitting next to each other. Let's go. <laughs> Shoja has girl in her guard dog. That's a good one. Oh, hold on. Oh, Kazukun, welcome back. What's up with you two? Why are they together? What are they talking about? Oh, uh, she's so cute, you know. <laughs> yeah, yeah. I just got kind of jealous. <laughs> well, good. Do you do any model work? Oh, no, no. She's not looking for a fight. But if you're that cute, Kazu must be super pushy with you, right? <laughs> huh? I mean... He doesn't have much experience yet, so sometimes he gets this scary look in his eyes. <laughs> <laughs> Hold on. Hold on, we got a long mommy chan line right now. Hold on. Once. <laughs> oh, fuck, I lost it. Once, you know. I wore a mini skirt on a date, and he was all, I can't stand up right now. I kissed him once, and he demanded it the next date. Even if he didn't go back. This voice is Mami Chan. Mami Chan is the Batman voice, because it was requested by Shivam. He always tried to hold my hand every time, and he always took me out to these late. Fuck. <laughs> Muscle man. <laughs> Late night, Izakaya has to eat. It's like Kazukun. He's such a guy, you know. <laughs> oh. Oh, God. I might have to retire the Batman voice. I don't know if I can do that. Especially if she has any continual... <laughs> Uh, I'm gonna have to have some lozenges after this. <coughs> Sorry. <coughs> okay. Yeah, I, I'm gonna have to go back to the Valley Girl. I don't know if I can do Mommy Chan anymore. I 
literally can't talk. Hold on. I'm so sorry, guys. <laughs> Oh my god. I'm gonna have to- I'm gonna go away for a second. I'll be right back in like a minute. I need to like re- <laughs> I need to re-moisten my throat or something. <laughs> I'll be right back. Uh, I'm so sorry, guys. <sighs> oh, my God. I'll have you know... When I was uh, filming my CMX video, doing the Batman voice, uh, I literally had to do this for like an hour, maybe? I think I filmed for like 30 minutes to an hour. This is worse somehow. I didn't even do that much dialogue from her. And my voice is... <sighs> Throat coat. That's exactly what I was drinking when I was sick. Throat coat is so good. Uh, my friend Fatima told me about a little, uh, told me about a little, uh, medicine hack or a little, uh, I can't remember what they called it, but, um, uh, hot milk, uh, cardamom, ginger, and what I did was a uh, hot milk and the throat coat tea steeped in it. It was very good. Uh, it is literally physically hurting me reading this manga. All right, let's end this. It's like a Kazukun. Okay, that's gonna be Mommy Chan's voice. I can't do the Batman anymore. R.I.P. the Batman voice. I can't do it. Especially if I'm going to do this two more times when we do the other volumes. Uh, okay. It's like Katsukun. He's like such a good eye, you know? Whoa, that's enough, Mommy John. Huh? Why? Aren't I right, Kazukun? Uh, 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 I don't like that. Uh huh. I want you to stop bad-mouthing my Kazuya-san. Whoa, lady. Uh, so sorry. I, like, I didn't mean it like that. I wasn't bad-mouthing anyone. But you still said it. That's so thoughtless, talking about your relationship with other people. I feel so bad for Kazuya-san. 
Oh, okay, Mizahara-san. I'm so sorry if you got angry, but Kazuka and I always go on like this. Whoa, girls, keep it down. And that means you can say whatever you want? No, I mean, it's just playing around, isn't it, Kibe chan uh, no, 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 uh, I don't know. Hey, you have to apologize to Kazu Kazu-kun. Who's that? Is that Surfer Bro? I don't know. Anyway. What are you talking about, Cheezer? Uh, I almost forgot her name! What are you talking about, Chorizo? I... I'm always like this. I'm going home. Whoa, Kazuya, you gonna just let her? Um, one virgin breeze. And another beer for me, please. Get him, Mami-chan. Woo, that was fun. Heading home. See ya. Hey, you good? Put your GF through that. At least call her, dude. Yeah, I don't know her number. I can't say that to him. Uh, it doesn't matter. It's just a temporary thing anyway. Kibe and everyone else don't know anything. Leave leave me alone. Temporary, huh? Is he okay? I I know for sure. Mizuhara did that because I look so pathetic. But this is fine. She's just a rental. A relationship summarized in a one-page service agreement. I knew you'd be mubbing. You okay, Kazukin? M mommy John, she followed me? Is your girlfriend alright? Uh huh? Uh, of course. She just needed to cool off a bit. She's a strong woman. I didn't know you could really act like a man, Kazukin. I'm a failure as a GF, huh? M mommy John, when she stood up for you? I like that. I get all shy and stuff. What the? Mommy John. I can't say it as strongly as her. You're being super assertive. Hey, we're near my place. Wanna rest a little bit? Mommy Chan, you're better than this. Everyone is better than this. I want to take a second to say, if you know a person who is like Kazuya, you are better than them. You are better than them. And you always will be better than them. And unless they show they are okay with changing, and unless they show that they could be a good person, and they could actually make progress, and they'll go to therapy, and they want to change, you don't have to be with them. And I want everyone to know that you are all better than a guy like this. Don't need someone like this. And that is my fucking pulpit for today. <clears throat> hey, you returning? I'm renting that. Oh? Can I keep it for one more week? Oh! We're at the end, baby! We're at the end! Oh, we finished it! We finished it! Oh my fucking god. We got ads at the end. Read Something's Wrong With Us instead. Read Sweat and Soap instead. Read Sayuki instead. Read Gleipner instead. Read, uh, actually, I don't know about Eden Zero. I, I definitely don't read Fire Force. Read Beyond the Clouds instead. Read Perfect World instead. I didn't even like this manga that much. Read it instead. I finished. I finished.
the end. Oh my fucking god. Fucking hell. Two and a half hours reading that. Two and a half hours. The things I do to help a good cause. That's right. Because today we were donating to the PCRF, the Palestine Children's Relief Fund, who help provide free medical care to thousands of injured and ill children yearly who lack local access to care within the local health care system. Please help the people in Palestine who are suffering right now during this genocide. Okay. I am cooked. I am cooked. We're two and a half hours in. Yeah, see, I, I watched two episodes of Fire Force, three episodes maybe, and a uh, girl's bra kept falling off, and I was like, can't do this. Which is unfortunate, because I did like Soul Eater, even though Soul Eater also had quite a bit of fan service. But, um... Okay, I will spend the next five minutes doing a Q&A. How do I start a Q&A? Ask me questions. Start Q&A. I don't know if I did that right. Uh, just so I can have like a calm down. Just need a second to relax, you know? Okay. Favorite rag character? Chorizo. Fucking love Chorizo. She's my girl. Fave moment of volume one? Hmm. Fave moment of volume one. Was it when he thought of getting cucked? Or maybe it was when he thought of getting cucked. Or maybe it was when he thought of getting cucked. Or maybe it was when he thought of getting cucked. Or maybe it was when he thought of getting cucked. Will you ever do a video on Kadocha? Um. <laughs> oh, good. Uh, also glad I stopped the Batman voice. Um, uh, we'll see about the Kadocha. I did uh, watch some of season one recently again, but um, I don't know. When I, when I like have essays, I want to like talk about something specifically within a series, and I don't have that with Kadocha right now, so. Okay. Thank you, lovely blood, for showing up. Uh... Team Chorizo or Team Mami-chan? Uh, I'm Team Chorizo and Team Mami-chan staying the fuck away from this guy. <laughs> How would you kill Kazuya? Um, I would kill him by not talking to him. And just letting him, you know, just like revel in, in whatever the fuck he revels in. Is this the worst thing you've read? Surprisingly, no. Uh, I have read a worse series. It's called Desire Climax. It's literally the worst thing I've ever read. Uh, but also, I did finish that one. So maybe if I finish Rent a Girlfriend. Play You Need Jesus by Young Gravy. Top five cuck moments of Rag Value 1. <laughs> and it's funny because there is enough to go in a top five. 
I could probably do a top 10 if I wanted. When he got kicked. Uh, when, when Chorizo slapped him, when Chorizo kicked him, when Chorizo yelled at him, when she yelled at him again. <clears throat> What's your rating of Rent-A-Girlfriend? One. <laughs> uh, Kazuya becoming a feminist happily single should be the ending for this manga. I loved Kodocha, the Funimation channel programming block on Colors TV. I used to play it and Fruits Basket back to back every weekday between 2006 and 2008. Those were the fun times. I don't think I ever had the Funimation channel back then, but I did rent, not a girlfriend. I did rent an anime from the library. I rent fruits. I rented Fruits Basket from the library, and I rented Kadocha from the library. And those are the ones that I read. Um, or read, watch. God, I'm I'm losing it, guys. I'm losing it. Uh, Thirty-three volumes to go. I am a hundred percent not finishing this series. I am only reading up to volume four for you guys. Because you were so kind to reach the donation goals both times. Uh, will you consider doing this video trend where the comment section recommends you mangas, manhwa, webtoons? You read 10 chapters and give their thoughts on them? We'll see. Maybe. Yeah, if you guys want a terrible series, read Desire Complex. That's a bad one. What Otome game would you put Kazuya in? Uh, whatever Otome game kills you. Oh, the the uh, the one where uh, like no matter what you get pushed off the building. That one. Uh, I have read Emma by Kaoru Mori. Uh, I liked it. I thought it was good. I do want to read a bride story at some point. But I just haven't gotten around to it yet. And I might I probably won't get around to it for a while. It's a pretty thick read. Would Kazuya work in a shoujo? Um, yeah, as the antagonist. <laughs> Otome is too good for Kazuya. Any WLW shoujo recs? Um there hasn't been as much shoujo uh Yuri series. But I would definitely recommend Run Away With Me Girl, um, even though we're adults. Princess of Sylph, that's a good one. Itsuwari no Marigold, that's a good one. Um, Pinky Candy Kiss, that's a good one. Um, oh god, what else is there? Oh, she loves to cook, she loves to eat, and should. Those are all some good ones. Uh, I dropped Desire Complex as well. Good for you. The funny thing about Desire Complex is that I read that series three different times, and I didn't realize it every time I started it. Unfortunately, for some reason, I couldn't get into How Do We Relationship. I know everyone loves that one. Uh, but for some reason, I just couldn't get into it. I, I don't know if it's because the way they talked was a little, like, strange to me. I don't know. Um, but yeah, unfortunate, because I know a lot of people like that one. Uh, same with Bloom Into You. A lot of people like that one, and I read a few chapters, and I just couldn't get into it. But I wouldn't be opposed to getting back into it at some point. Will you read a manga you like on stream? We'll see. I mostly just did the stream because, you know, I, I promised that I would um, do this. But uh, if you guys are if you guys are wanting more, maybe at some point. Uh, how do we relationship has a rough first volume? Did I read the first volume? I think I read two volumes of it. I think I read 11 chapters? I'm not sure. I, I can't remember. Because how do, how do we relationship was going to be my GL series that I wanted to read last year. 
And I ended up reading Cocoon Entwined instead because I didn't like How Do We Relationship that much. And I really wanted to read a GL still. So I put Cocoon Entwined instead. Um, uh, today in Argentina, an editorial announced Yakuza Lover. Do you know it? What do you think of it? Is it a good manga? If you like kind of like, not trashy, but like, a, a smutty, campy series, then I think you'll like that one. Um, it's not like my favorite thing ever, but if that's like what you're into, then I think you might like it. I am not going to watch the Rent-A-Girlfriend anime. Absolutely no way. I will not be subjecting myself to that. Uh, speaking of GL, have you read Tamen, no Tamen de Gushi? Uh, I read a bit of it, but I'm not very good with series that are only, like, uh, how do I, how do I explain? Series that don't really have, like, a plot and are more random, uh, like, aspects of life. I don't like those as much. Uh, so I read some of it, and the art is really pretty, but, um. Yeah, I just couldn't get into it mostly just because of that. Have you read Yakuza Fiance? Love Yakuza Fiance. Just picked up volume six yesterday. So excited for the anime for that one. I'm pretty sure it was announced. I think that one's getting an anime. The series is a lot of fun. I love my yandere crazy man. You know me. I love my yandere crazy mans. <laughs> Mayu Shinjo. I haven't watched Revolutionary Girl Utena yet. I know. I think I will at some point this year. Um, have you read any of Moyoko Ano's manga? I've read In the Clothes Called Fat. If you can handle um, stuff about eating disorders, that's a really good series. Um, but that one's really good. I have not read Wild Strawberries. I've heard it's really good, though. Would Rent-A-Girlfriend be better if it was gender-swapped? You know what? I think... I think there kind of is a similar one. Hold on. Ah! Yeah, I'm pretty sure... I can't pull it out because um, it's like all the way under all of my other stuff. But there's a series... I'll put it in the... Um, Put it in the comments. It's called B-O-D-Y, or body. Um, it never completed in English. Uh, Viz ended up dropping it. But I think the guy is like uh, like a host. Um, and it's kind of a similar premise. Uh, I actually really like that series, though. I remember I really liked it when I was a kid. Um, I have read She Loves to Cook, She Loves to Eat. Very good series. Have you read Ikeda Ryoko? I have. I've read Rose of Versailles and Claudine now. I really like Claudine. I wish it was longer. Have you read Wildcom or Chicago by Yumi Tamura? I read Chicago. I haven't read Wildcom yet, even though I have it on my shelf over there. I just haven't gotten around to it. Um... Chicago's good, but it's only two volumes, and it never really got to, like, really, like, become something, if that makes sense. Uh, but if you just want to read stuff from Yumi Tamora, I, I think you should definitely check it out. Uh, oh, when I asked what Dragnet is, it's a police term and also is a TV show. Got it. Thank you. Yeah, I had no idea what that was. Uh, I haven't read Cheerful Amnesia, but I have seen that author around. Um, I am interested in reading the other one that just came out from them. The 
I can't remember what the name is. Something. I just know the cover is like the girl doing this. Uh, have you read Honey and Clover? I've never read Honey and Clover, but I did uh, watch the first episode of the anime. I wasn't super into it, but um, I'm not opposed to trying it again. When you get around to Rotena, will you start with the anime or the manga? Very different feeling. Probably the anime, because I've heard a lot of people say that same thing of like uh, the manga and the anime are very different, so... I'll probably end up watching the anime and and checking out the manga afterwards. Goodness. Did you guys hear that? What? What? Okay. Just got here. Is the reading done already? Yeah, I could only get up to one volume today. I've been streaming for two hours and 40 minutes. <laughs> um, oh, Cheerful Amnesia is better. Okay. Pongo uh, wants to speak. Pongo has opinions. Yeah, I guess because Pongo's yelling at me, that's probably a good sign to head out. Uh, he... A little sassy boy. He loves those sass me. Your post from earlier. Are they reprinting Red River? Hell yes. We got three in ones from Red River. From this. And we are also getting Kagen no Suki. Or it's called, I think they're calling it Last Quarter by Ayazawa. If you guys are into Ayazawa, we got a new one. I'm actually very excited for that one because it's one of the... Um, it's one of the uh, ones that I've been wanting to read from Ayazawa. Isn't Wolf Girl and Black Prince kind of reverse rent a girlfriend? Yeah, I think that's a good that's a good comparison. Although I kind of like I kind of like Wolf Girl and Black Prince. I kind of like that one. <laughs> All right. Well, thank you so much, guys, for coming and donating and hitting the goal today. I very much appreciate it. You guys are the best. Um, I will try to let everyone know when I'm going to do volume two. If I'm going to do volume two, I already bought all three volumes, so I kind of have to at some point. Uh, but that is all for tonight. Thank you so much for watching. Thank you so much if you donated. I appreciate every single one of you. Pongo, what do you got to say, bud? It's your time. Speak. Anything else? Anything else you got to say? You just want to lay down? All right. That's all for tonight. Thank you so much, my hojos, for watching. I hope you guys have a great weekend and a fantastic rest of your night. Goodbye. I've lost my mind. My girl Chorizo. We are out of it. Goodbye now. Bye-bye. Bye-bye.